Hey guys, CJ back here with a attempt at describing how to play Call of Duty, Call of Duty without vision. Um, right now, I'm just navigating the menu system to get to a solo match in Zombies. On normal difficulty, on the classified map, I'm loading into the main lobby right now. Create a class, and I'm picking my special weapon, equipment, starting weapon, and my perks are going to stay the same because I know what they were last night. So, how would I describe Call of Duty to a blind person, um, and how to play it? Now, you use which weapon charged, you click like that. Uh, square is your main interact button, X is jump, which you hardly ever need in zombies at all. Uh, circle is crouch, which again, hardly ever need. Unless you're sprinting, you can uh, crouch slide to give yourself a little bit of a boost in, in uh, maneuverability. And then triangles to switch weapons. Um, as I said earlier, you use your left stick to move around, forward, backward, left, oh, and right. Oh, so if you pay attention to facility. the sound of the game, I can hear the box spawning on the left side. And from where I'm standing, I'm going to turn the sound up. So you can hear, like, there's like burning on one of the desks. Uh, behind me, so I'm going to move backward and to my left, and there's the doorway I just opened. Now my footsteps are different because I'm in a different hallway leading toward a elevator, which I'll hear the music and a whispering sound. So there's the glass. You can't really hear the music from where I'm standing. So it's faint, but... There we go, turn it up. At least I tried to. And you can hear the direction of every zombie. I can even tell you which barrier they're coming through right now. All six of them are in the main room. One just came through the doorway. Headshot. I am terrible. with you, bourgeois zombie. And you heard clearly when the round ends, there's a round ending sound and a musical cue. So now I'm on round two. And uh, each time you kill a zombie with a knife, you get 150 points. Headshots, 100 points. And I think just a normal grenade or bullet that kills, uh, it's like 60 or 80 points. I don't remember exactly. Um, but the, the key is every kill gets you points. It's not per bullet, like uh, previous Call of Duty Zombies titles. Purpose? What was... Let me turn it back down. Excellent. Why help him still chasing us? And hey, where's my vodka? Now, how does a blind person do all this? Well, like I like I told you, I tried tried uh, clarifying. There's directional audio for with the way the engine works. It's not like verticality speaking. Like you can't really determine verticality forward back. Uh, you can determine depth and distance. Um, a lot of details in the sound design. Even with the game turned down, I can still. Hear it well enough. Mr. Box, random gun, let's see what I get. Got the VKM. It's heavy LMG. And I identified that through sound as well. Rebuild some barriers. And it's like there, there's a lot of little sound contextual sound cues for you to understand what's going on. So it's not like impossible to play. It just takes time, just like any other game, to learn and practice, right? Literally, I just got a headshot down the hallway. Shotgun LMG, let's go. This is the Mog 12 shotgun. I do have uh, attachments on it, by the way. And that's another thing. Uh, the menu system, uh, they added sound effects for perk machines. 
so you can find your perk machine. So like say you put the say quick revive perk which heals you faster. Let's say you put that on your first slot on your creator class, which I covered the menu in a previous video. But you can hear which machine is which, so you can pick up the right perk. You want to pick them all up in, in general, but you can identify what perk you want and you can place it where you want. Um, your customization for your guns, they have sounds tied to each attachment, so you can identify what attachment is which. So you can, if you want, if you really wanted to, you can go through this menu system and memorize the sound of everything in the game and understand what you're selecting and what you're picking. A lot of the sounds sound similar, but there's little distinctions between them, so you can you can definitely memorize them and, and say, hey, you want to put a, a fast mag to reload faster and high caliber to do extra damage to headshots, so you can do that with that vision. You can do the same thing with your elixirs too. Like I mentioned earlier, one of the elixirs teleports you randomly. Another one gives you electric knife that spreads like a chain lightning. So there's a lot of subtle audio cues that you can listen for and it can definitely help you with uh, Call of Duty specifically. Now, if this video was educational at all or helpful at all, um, and you're blind, visually impaired, Uh, let me know. Let me know if it helped. And if there's if there's one thing I want to say before, there's my special weapon. Let's see what I can get from the box now. Why is so expensive? Nikolai only wants not to die. See what I get, see what I get. <laughs> it's okay, box. Nikolai already dead on inside. Now Nikolai can be dead on outside too. <laughs> <laughs> I got the cap 45. It's a machine pistol, it's not great, but uh. Wait a minute, I shot off wrong arm. Nikolai is poor, sad man. But at least he has vodka to drink. We'll see. Okay, my son's awake, so I'm gonna get off here. If you guys find it helpful, let me know. And yeah, thanks for watching.